Well guys, after being here a week, this is what I have. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11 sheds and one that I left on the mountain. That makes 12. I really only shed hunted about five days. I was rained out the other two. So five days, that many sheds. Not bad for not knowing what the heck I'm doing on this side and kind of getting screwed with the weather and not being able to go where I wanted to. I checked this morning and I am going to be able to get into where I wanted to go. Problem is we're going to have to backpack in, go in as far as we can on the four wheeler. It's still super muddy and then backpack in, sleeping overnight. We'll do, we'll go in tomorrow morning early, spend the night, shed hunt the next day, come out. Hopefully we can at least double our sheds, maybe find some browns or some bigger ones at least. Uh, these ones aren't that bad though, they're pretty nice, nice bowls, just uh, didn't find that many of them. So I got the truck running now, charging up some gear. That's a crummy thing about the Toyota is you have to have the accessories or the truck on to charge anything. I'm gearing up. Now I'm gonna take that tarp, roll out the sleeping bag on it, sleep on that. I'm gonna take that gas because we will run out. We're going in far, some extra water, and I'm gonna get the gear loaded now in the pack. So all we have to do in the morning is drive out and start shed hunting. It's some pretty neat country, just uh, don't know what to expect. There is three guys that are in there now that drove in this morning, so they'll probably pick up any gimmies. But there's always leftovers, and especially in country like this, there's gotta be some sheds. All right, so some of you guys might appreciate this. I thought it was pretty cool. So it says National Forest Plantation. Species, Ponderosa. That's these pine trees right here. So they were planted. Age, it says two to zero. I don't really know what that means, but year was 1965 by Ron R. something. That's pretty cool. So 1965, and it's 2019 now. So these puppies are a lot, lot older than they look like they would be, you know, 55 years or whatever. It was kind of funny that, uh, I noticed that little post to read that because I was thinking it looked like there was layers to these trees like they were planted. And I thought that's kind of weird though, way up here on the mountain. But apparently they were. That's kind of cool, glad that little sign was there. Shout outs to Ron for planting the trees. Had an elk come right by camp today. One, and then another elk track right here. Two, and then the deer. The shenanigans we do when we're trying to kill time. Go between. Hey, go between. Playing ball. Wait. Okay. Playing ball with Tracker while we wait for the sun to set to go to bed. We got back kind of at a weird time where we we're too late in the day to go out and do anything, but then, uh, Kind of got back too early to like just go to eat and go to sleep. So we're just kind of hanging out before Operation Hail Mary tomorrow. Raspberry crumble. So there's four servings. They're all going to me. Pour the cookies in next. I'm going to eat it out of this bowl. But I'm also going to put a twist on it. Put some peanut butter in. I may have put too much water in. I didn't have a measuring cup to tell. But let's see what it looks like. Here it goes. Raspberry crumble. And it looks like I put the perfect amount of water in. Maybe not enough water. But that's how I like it. There's that. Mm -hmm. Give me all the sugar. Holy cow. Someone's going to have a stomach ache tomorrow. That's going to be good. Doesn't look as good as it's gonna taste, but I'm sure you guys can imagine. Eat this, check my Onyx maps where I'm gonna go tomorrow. I'm liking that spot right there. Looks like a bear crap. <laughs> it honestly does, as gross as that is. Looks just like a bear crap. Tracker had some hamburger, dog food, medicine. And that's it for today. And in case you guys were wondering, 
and it tastes freaking great. It'd be good with or without the peanut butter, but the peanut butter just adds a little more fat and protein to it and a little extra taste.